We got your weather, we got your news, we got your sports updates and your food. This the morning's at Mount. This the morning's at Mount. We got your weather, we got your news, we got your sports updates and your food. This the morning's at Mount. Yeah, this the morning's at Mount. Uh. Good morning, Mount Pleasant Green Knights. I'm Andrew. And I'm Bridget. And this is Mornings at Mount. Today is Friday, March 22nd, and is a sixth day. Now please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please stand for a moment of silence. Thank you. Please be seated. Today's weather will be sunny with a high of 50 and a low of 27. Tomorrow will be rainy with a high of 56 and a low of 37. A quick reminder to everyone, remember to grow. Get ready to learn, review what you know, and open your mind to wonder and ask questions because we are Mount. Now for our Women's History Fact. In the tradition of President Carter's inaugural Women's History Week proclamation, presidents have issued annual proclamations for more than 25 years that honor the role of women in U.S. history. In 2021, President Joe Biden's proclamation focused especially on COVID and on the historic election of Vice President Kamala Harris. He said, At our current moment of crisis, women continue to lead, from vaccine researchers to public health officials to the countless heroines on the front lines. Women are working around the clock to defeat COVID-19. This year has also marked an historic milestone of women's leadership 232 years in the making with the inauguration of America's first woman vice president. Class of 2027 will be holding a fundraiser at the Christiana Mall on Monday, April 15th from 5 to 8 p.m. Let your friends and family know that everyone is welcome. Come out to support our freshman class. The National Honor Society invites you to take part in their blood drive in partnership with the Blood Bank of Delmarva on April 12th in the gymnasium. If you are 16 years of age or older, sign up using the QR code provided to ensure your time slot. We ask you to remember to eat, drink, and bring your ID, as well as a signed permission slip for those who are 16 years old. It's a great cause. If you have some extra blood you want to give away, now's your time. I'm not sure that's how that works. I think it is. Now for our sports. Yesterday, boys lacrosse competed against AI DuPont. Good luck to everyone competing today. Today for lunch, your options are turkey barbacoa with lime cilantro rice, fiesta ranch chicken burrito, and steamed green beans and chilled pineapples. Sounds delicious. Today is National Goof Off Day, so be a little extra silly. Be a little goofy, even. <laughs> How will you be goofy today, Bridget? Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll pull a prank on somebody. Oh, that's pretty goofy, yeah. Make sure to fill out the form linked in the video description if you want to put your announcement here on Mornings at Mount. Or go to the MPHS Library Schoology page and click the link in the updates. Also, Make sure to follow the Instagram page, at MPHTV, for more awesome student-led content like this. Lastly, go check out the Mount Student Newspaper on MPHSNightlyNews.com. That's all for today. Please click the subscribe button and hit that notification bell so whenever we come out with content, you'll be there to see it. Thank you, have an amazing day, and don't forget that we are accountable, respectful, and engaged because we, we are, are Mount. Mount. Bye! Bye.